Assalamu alaikum. Welcome all to Easy Human Anatomy channel. In this video, I discuss histology of the parathyroid gland. This is the histological image of parathyroid gland. The gland is covered by the connective tissue capsule. This is the connective tissue septum. The parenchyma of the gland contains two types of cells the chief cell and the oxyphil cells, and occasional adipocytes and blood vessels present within the gland. This is the H.E. strain image of parathyroid gland. This is the oxyphil cell. Oxyphil cells are much larger in size, 12 to 20 micrometer, and chief cells diameter is 6 to 8 micrometer. And in H.E. strain, oxyphil cells stained light pink, and chief cell stained dark purple. Oxyphil cell. This is the oxyphil cell. The cytoplasm of oxyphil cell is uh, filled by many large mitochondria, and in between mitochondria, cytoplasmic glycosan ribosome or endoplasmic reticulum, Golgi body, and secretory granules are present. This is the chief cell, and you see the cytoplasm content less organelle. Chief cells are two types active chief cell and inactive chief cell. Chief cell spend most time inactive due to the normal calcium level condition of the body. They contain less cell organelle than active cell, but more vacuolated and more central nucleus. The active chief cells is response to low calcium level in blood serum and low level calcium is sensed by the calcium sensing receptor. This active cell has a large electric density than the inactive chief cell. And this cell is tall and polygonal in shape with spherical and oval nuclei and its peripheral portion of the nuclei contain heterochromatin. The cytoplasm of these cells is differently scattered ribosomes abundant evenly distributed mitochondria and some Golgi apertures, lipid droplet and rough endoplasmic reticulum. So this is all about the parathyroid gland. If you like this video, please press the like button and please subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching.